Hello everyone, welcome to another video of uh, One UI 7. Uh, here I'm going to compare uh, the gallery options or the gallery updates that came with One UI 7 when compared with One UI 6.1. Uh, let's compare both devices. On my left hand I have One UI 6.1 and on the right hand I have uh, One UI 7. Um, let's navigate to the gallery. So here you can see like um, the font is somewhat bolder and uh, the menu bar at the bottom the navigation bar you can see uh, new icons uh, for pictures albums and stories it looks like uh, windows phone design language uh, in windows phone you can see icons all over the ui so now um, let's go to the settings menu uh, it looked a lot like similar but uh, you can see a new icon for uh, uh, studio and instead of suggestions, you now have a clean out option. Let me navigate to that. Here we have the same thing, suggestions and clean out. Okay, let's go back. Let's go to the settings. So here you can see uh, super SDR option was earlier available, but in one way seven, there is no option to control uh, super HDR uh, from gallery settings and we have the same full screen scrolling autoplay motion photos you can see a new option here open in video player so what does it do let's check let me open any one video yeah here you can see um, there is an option to play video so if I click that so it's playing in video player you can see the video player icon uh, in the recent menu it is directly playing in the video player instead of uh, playing the video within the gallery itself so and that's one change with the one way seven and you can toggle the same so if i uh, turn off open in video player and if i go back to yeah now i can see the controls film strip here you can adjust the videos and everything here video sync bar here so earlier uh, we can only be able to open the video in the video player and here we can able to um, uh, use screenshot option and uh, we can see through the video we also have a photo editor settings option so if you go here we have photo assist so these are galaxy a options another one drawing assist and uh, the permissions okay and uh, there is an option to uh, edit the raw image so we can turn off uh, down from photo editor settings there is a section called stories here we have auto create stories button but here we don't have any customization service here we can see uh, auto create stories and uh, when creating auto stories right so we have the options to hide dates you can um, hide the content or uh, photos or videos that was taken on selected dates and you can also hide people and people. so this is one another um, new feature added with one way seven mm, okay and then in albums yeah we have uh, the same kind of settings so place names and everything else and finally in the gallery labs and in the gallery labs you can see there are new options enabled so for one way seven alone we have a new search foreground analysis toggle um, so if you enable the toggle you can see um there is a new um, persistent notification is appearing uh, i'm not sure what this means but uh, this stays active in the um, notification um we can also stop it i'm not sure what this is maybe uh, in the future updates we will be able to know uh, what um, this option means and then we have show sticky data and location so you can see uh, the hamburger menu in viewer bottom and show menu in viewer bottom so it's like uh, it's for one-handed usability if you enable this the three dots you can uh, menu will be shifted to the bottom instead of the top menu and here you can see a new option in uh, one way seven open in other window yeah so this is new i have just enabled it so let me um look into the other options I think we have a similar yeah so i think at the bottom we have even more version numbers version information so in, in 1.6.1 1 
we just have a smaller set of uh, version information but uh, in 187 we have a broad range of uh, um, version numbers for each of the apps and services uh, within camera and gallery so this is new okay let's go back to the pictures and see what's new with uh, opening another window so we have an option to open in another window um yeah so we have two set here so you can compare actually you can compare uh, the images from bottom to top so maybe this feature is useful for comparison between two images earlier it was not available and this is cool see here you can see we can able to compare uh, two icons here if I open the image, um, let's see. So the same open another window option is displayed here. And then if you notice at the bottom, there's a new Galaxy A icon at the bottom menu. So you can quickly navigate to um, Galaxy A um, edit options instead of doing a double click to navigate to the Galaxy A option. So this is new. And then uh, if we select an image, the subject was highlighted in one way seven but it was not um, in the one way six dot one and we can also able to erase the image from here so this is not a galaxy a feature instead uh, it's like an uh, object erase feature which is already available in the gallery the short types ui was updated in the one way seven you can see how many videos portraits raw images give panorama and everything so this is a nice, nice little addition in the one 7 so we can able to um, um, see the differences between the two one 6.1 six one we just have only the short types but we also have the number of um, videos portraits and uh, every other category so this is nice I search the search UI was also modified so in the, in the recent searches in one 6.1 six one we just have only the um, suggestions and uh, the recent searches here um, it has a more translucent view so let me click this one yeah it brought up the search results um, in 106.1 we have uh, the locations and everything but here we only have the images so if we scroll okay and there is one filter option here where you can filter only the selfies okay and here we have a menu but that is absent in 106.1 so from the menu we can able to select and uh, uh, start a slideshow or uh, create uh, any videos or slideshows from here i hope i covered everything in the gallery see you in another video thank you so much bye bye